Hey, it's Clay, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol MRNA. We will take a look at the 30-minute time frame. I'm not sure what I mean by 30-minute. I do offer an explanation video at that link. Well, the price pulled back a bit today, uh, which was bearish, but overall, the, the chart's hanging in there, and this will mean a little bit more to those of you that watched the video previously, but for those of you that watched the previous video, I talked about this 122-ish area, 122.50 as a key level of support, and you can see, surprise, surprise, the power of charts. That is basically right where the price went sideways above there. In fact, that candle right there basically bounced right off that level. And the reason why that is an important area is, you know, to build a little context here real quickly, on Wednesday, that right here from the price being all the way down there to all the way up there, that was a super nice move. Very impressive bounce, which led into today, Thursday, with the question of, all right, yeah, but I mean, was that sort of movement truly strong? And it all became a, a question of, well, can the price at least build and show signs of progress? And the quote unquote sign of progress was that 122.50 mark, because with the price down here and holding above it, assuming it would go back up, what would that be giving you? Well, that would be giving you a set of lows there. That would be giving you a set of lows right there. And if you envision those as stair steps, well, hey, you still do have progress being made in the upwards direction. So that's why it was important that, yeah, sure, today, not necessarily good that it gapped down uh, and pulled back a little bit, but it's not like the price totally crashed and is now you know sitting back down here where it already was, because that just wouldn't be a, a sign of genuine power at all. So from that angle of things, sure, a little bit of annoyance, but it did hold strong, which is what you wanna see because there is still the opportunity to, again, show that quote unquote sign of progress. As far as areas of resistance are concerned, if the price continues to bounce back upwards, first key level to watch closely is gonna be that purple line there, the 50 period, simple moving average, and that's currently valid. We'll call it the 130, 125 mark. So watch that, but in my opinion, at least the top priority right now is not necessarily breaking levels of resistance, but more so going through some healthy consolidations and building higher bases. So let's see if the price can get that job done or not moving forward. First off, thanks so much for watching the entire video. Real quick, before you go, I wanna invite you to a live webinar, web class, training, workshop, online event, whatever you wanna call it, but it will be me live revealing to you what I discovered that has allowed me to transform myself from being an employee to being my own boss, including how I had only one losing day out of 73 days in total. I'm gonna to cover three keys that have helped me unlock profitable consistency within the markets. The first key is super weird, but in a productive type of way. The second key is super awesome because it quite literally is wired into our DNA as humans, making it very easy to use. But in a cruel way, this becomes a pitfall for many traders. I'll explain it all though, including how to avoid the pitfall that it creates for some. And yeah, the third key, when you hear it, sounds way too good, way too, good to be true, but it's not, and I'll show you how it all works. Then at the end, I open it up for a question and answer session that is, again, totally live. Even if you can't make the live session, please still sign up as it will be recorded, and you can go back and watch the replay that I will send you. Click the image on the screen or click the link down in the description box so you can get the date and time and claim your spot, which I should note is limited due to the fact that this truly is a live event. If you have any questions, let me know. If not, I'll be seeing you soon.